Hey YouTube, welcome back to another beer review. It's time for some mystery beer from uh, the Brother Beer Box. As you can see, uh, each month they uh, send us, the Dutch Beer Collector, a, a box of beers with a theme um, with uh, six different beers, including one uh, mystery beer. This month uh, it is uh, the theme of Trappist beers. So this is going to be a Trappist beer, but what kind of is it, it is? Um, I also have to review. Uh, we also do uh, one review uh, of all the beers. Um, each member of the Dutch Beer Collective is going to do one review. I still have to review mine. Uh, I got the box when I was on holiday, so didn't have the time. So sorry about that. But it's going to be. Um, on the channel very very soon um, but we're starting off with this uh, mystery beer so if you wanna if you're in the Netherlands and you're Dutch you can order the box uh, I think they even ship uh, into Europe I think uh, so uh, go to the the website and uh, look up the, the Dutch beer collective box soon there will be another box uh, I don't know what theme uh, that's going to be, but um, can't wait to find out. So let's open it up and see what it's like. So what is Mystery Beer? Mystery Beer is uh, a beer wrapped like this, and I'm going to try to uh, guess what uh, kind of beer it is, what style it is, uh, what brewery, maybe what country, uh, the ABV, and I'm going to say what I think of it. So let's open it up and see what it's uh, what it's like. So there we go. Ooh, I can smell it already over here. This is what the bottle cap looks like, because it might be uh, it might say what the brewery is. So let's pour it in. Let's see what it's like. That pours a very dark brown color with a khaki colored hat. And that looks like a quadruple to me. Really nice bit of light at the bottom. So it could be uh, one of the Trappist uh, breweries. So it could be Dutch, it could be uh, something from Belgium, something from Austria, maybe. A French one. Or maybe it's one from the US. They don't actually make beer anymore, but they used to. So it could be an old bottle. Who knows? Let's go to the nose. It's got that. A nice chocolatey uh, dark red fruit uh, licorice vibe. Smells really nice. It smells like a quadruple. So, by the looks of it and by the smell of it, I think it's a quadruple. Let's uh, have a sip. For the beer, thanks for the beer. Hmm. That is definitely a quadruple. Um, nice chocolatey five at the end of the sip. Uh, sweet, malty, uh, dark red fruits. Um, very chocolatey and a tiny bit of licorice. Um, sticky. Definitely about... Uh, nine or ten percent um so what uh, could this be um i'm hoping it's a westflateren um nowadays in the netherlands you can uh, get westflateren in every bottle sh in, well, not every bottle shop but uh, loads of bottle shops in the netherlands because they um it's available in shops nowadays so that's kind of cool but I don't think it is. Why? Because I don't feel 
the there's a um, thing on the bottle when, which you can feel like a tiny band around uh, the bottle. It's not there, so I think it's a um, quadruple nine ten percent. I think it's a uh, uh, beer from La Trappe. Why? I have no idea. I just think it is. So what we're going to do is um, open it up, see what it's like. Is it a good quadruple? Yeah, I think it's really nice. Um, it's been ages since I had um, the La Trappe quadruple, so I may be, might be very wrong, but it's a really nice one. So let's open it up and see what is, uh, which uh, Trappist Brewery it is. Should be fun if it's a Spencer. Which, which is, uh, I had uh, a few of their beers. So, what is, oh, some nice golden wrapping on the inside oh it's not it is not no it is the one from austria didn't guess that one right uh it's a uh a beer with the name uh gregorius uh trappist beer uh from stift Engelzell Österreichis uh, Erzeugnis by German or Austria is pretty crappy. It's a, uh, let me see what. An extra strong ale. Ingredients water, malted barley, honey, hops yeast. That explains the kind of sweet thing. Um, so it's a strong, I don't know what on tap says it is, but it's 10.5%, so I was, I was kind of right. Um, yeah, I don't think I ever had this one. I don't know, I have to look that up on on tap. Um, but yeah, it's a, it's a really nice beer. I love it. Um, if you want to know the score, go to my on tap. I'm also on Facebook and Instagram. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Um, if you don't already, um, I'm going to enjoy the rest of this beer. And uh, hopefully I will see you soon with another mystery beer. Cheers.